What's going on, folks? This is Clayton over at AndroidAuthority.com. Today I've got an app review of the Adaptext Beta keyboard. Now we're just going to be using the LG Optimus 4X HD, and I'm going to compose a memo to show you the Adaptext keyboard. Now, as you can see here, it has a nice clean layout. It's very cool looking, and uh, you can see that we have our suggestion bar on top, which is one of the main features of the Adaptex keyboard. It uh, is really pushing for the um, suggestions and the predictions, and then we also have automatic text replacement, which is a very cool intuitive feature. But we'll just walk through some of these simple uh, steps with the Adaptex keyboard to start off. Now this is our adapt text menu if we long press, but if we don't long press, we can just access our numbers and our punctuation, and we've got two pages of that. I'm going to just go through there. We can go back. As you can see, every single key, if you long press, it accesses the um, icon in blue above the letter or the piece of punctuation, whatever you're using. We have our voice input. We've got our capitalization. This is a very cool share to networks um, social media sort of option that I'll show you here in a second. And then we have our suggestion bar with drop down menu to show us the rest of these suggestions. Now I'll go into the Adaptex settings before I actually demo the keyboard by long pressing the Adaptex button there. You can see we have our private mode off which stops the uh, keyboard from learning the words you type. So if you want to type some naughty messages to your girlfriend or whatnot. Um, <laughs> we've got our layouts. We can remove the accents and diacritics. We can access our settings and we can access our ATR options. So I'll just go to the settings super quick. We have our My Dictionary, which uh, is the list of words that the Adaptex keyboard has learned from your use. We have our Add-on Manager, and the add-ons have a lot of different options. We can see here that we have the English US selected as the current keyboard language. We can also choose uh, Business US, and because they're industry specific, there's like medical and there's IT industry. We've also got our English for the UK. There's a bunch of different languages you can all download from the Play Store. And then we can prioritize our add-ons, so if we have more than one, we can uh, choose which one is actually the priority and which one it will predict more often than not. So we can go back. We can personalize our suggestions by uh, logging into some social accounts, such as Facebook or Twitter, or we can also import the Android keyboard in to learn, such as uh, the words we've already uh, typed on the Android keyboard before using the Adapt Text Beta. We have our automatic text replacement on, which I'll show you here in a minute, where we can go to our shortcuts and expansions. So as you see here, HRU, when you type it in, would expand to how are you, but I'll actually add one just so we can demo it in the video. And I'll do IAF, whoops, IAF, which will expand to I am fine. So we'll just save that for further use here in a minute. Anyways, we have our autocorrection, and we have the autocorrection mode. We can have extended character bubbles, and we can choose our interactive feedback settings, whether we want the haptic feedback, the vibrate, or the sound on press. Then we can go to uh, liking adapt text on Facebook, and we can uh, rate them. But anyways, we'll just uh, demo some of the actual keyboard's use on the memo here. So uh, as I begin typing, we can actually see that it'll predict... Typing, and I'll put a comma, the Adaptext keyboard learns what I type. As you can see there, it uh, suggested some stuff there in the suggestion bar. And we can also drop it down to suggest more. But we can uh, go down here, and I'll show you some of the ATR, the automatic text replacement, where we can press HRU, and we'll just press the one with the plus button, and it expands to hi, how are you? And we can do the IAF. Whoops. I'm always hitting the O. IAF, I'm fine. So we have our automatic text replacement feature, which is very cool. It's an intuitive feature uh, by the Adaptext keyboard. Now, um, to access the languages we're actually doing this in, we can long press the English there, and if we have more downloaded, we can access them there, or we can drop down the keyboard, and uh, if we long press here, it will just go away. But anyways, you can, um, let's see, I have a status worthy sentence, and if I want to post that, I can long press the social media button. And we can post to Facebook, Twitter, and more. Now, if you want to log in with your Facebook, you can do so, or you can log in with your Twitter, but you can simply just click one of those, and it will post to your social network of choice. 
So that's basically the Adaptex keyboard, guys. You can check out the beta version in the Play Store right now. So I would suggest checking it out. And if you like the videos, stay uh, updated with Android Authority by subscribing to our YouTube. Check out our website as well.